Hello everybody, welcome. This is Ben with the Taylor Fit Homes Group. Today, in today's video, we're gonna talk about doing a fix and flip. A lot of people are uh, curious about this. Uh, there's even a lot of beginning investors that try and um, tap into this. Uh, I would probably say on the medium to higher risk scale of the market. Um, and, and this is uh, an example that we're taking off of the South Austin area. Um, this property is not listed at this price, but let's just say that this property you could purchase for $180,000. Um, this is a three bedroom, one and a half bath. Uh, it is less than 900 square feet. We're gonna say the renovation budget on this property is 45,000. It would be possible potentially to get it fixed up for a little bit less. I have not personally seen the property or been there. So I'm just going off my experience and uh, knowing kind of what um, a renovation uh, cost might be for a property like this. Um, also, uh, it's important to kind of decide if you're gonna invest in a property like this, how are you gonna finance it? Now, there's two ways to pay for a property like this. You could do a cash purchase, uh, or you could do a hard money or private money purchase. And the costs to do one of those two options, either hard money or private money, are gonna be a little bit more costly for you. Uh, if you got the uh, purchase price at 180, and it was a renovation of 45,000, you'd be looking at $225,000 so far. And then if you were not to pay cash, you would have probably your loan and real estate costs come up another 25,000. You'd be all in at about $250,000 on the project. And the ARV, which is after repair value on this particular property would be in the neighborhood of $275,000 in today's market. Uh, that would give you a profit potential if you were using a hard money or private money situation, it would give you a profit potential of $25,000. And you would net a little bit more if you were paying cash, somewhere probably in the thirty-five dollars to $40,000 range. In the next video, we're going to talk about the same example, but we're going to talk about it from a fix and rent perspective. So we're going to show you the same breakdown, uh, except we're going to do is if you're not fixing it to sell it, you're actually looking to fix it and rent it and maybe hold it long term. 